Yeah. Very happy you pointed that out. It's very, very powerful as Mundo has been losing a lot. Clit's going to come in and find Fly. Those, that's the flash forward. Fly's going to flash and does get towards Dread as well, who's in the right area, so he'll survive. But it does mean both mid laners now without flash. Power of the Renex. So, oh, I love Are we this. doing it? We're returning. Trying to get on in there. Dissonance going to be enough, though, as cleared. He's pitching a tent here in the mid lane, and it doesn't look like much like it has been throughout the second round uh, of this summer season because there's not a whole lot of range on Afrika's side. I feel like Var uh, Rise will be able to do a fair bit of stuff, but Ruler, he's likely not going to be able to. His life's trying to keep him alive, but it is just not going to happen. Life now gonna get stunned up as Dread gets the chomp down, but that is first blood going over to Afrika and a great Again, start. Aggression from Afrika thus far. Only landed them one kill, but uh, has been successful as will fly. Yeah, does have his flash back up again as he's gonna flash over the Realm Warp, tries to get himself out of the way. Shockwave is gonna pull them back. Dazzle barely misses, but now Clit is very angry and will be able to catch up to the Orianna. So he gets. Yeah, Keen, I think missed that cannon as well. So Clit's going to make his way forward. Slice, dice, has the flash. He's going to use it immediately. The place that we talked about when this was picked up. I'm going to give a little bit more gold over as BD. Yeah, getting aggressive here onto Fly. He's running real fast. The Shockwave's going to try and pull him away. And good positioning there as Fly wants to get past the rise. But he's pitched himself a bit of a tent here in this brush as Clit and Life moving their way up as Dread puts down the pillar, flashes forward, Zenith plate's fantastic, and BDD is uh, going on Afrika's side. Does mean that our Gen G won't be able to rely on that win condition, and that's why they're going to be fighting for it, as we can see here. Cosmic Radiance is available, and Ruler, they're just going to try and turn on him. Chains of Corruption not quite working out there as Ruler flashes away, but now the positioning around the Drake is not exactly the best. <laughs> yeah, and Renekton, there's going to be a heck of a lot of healing, so neither of these teams going to feel very good about giving this one up. As, uh, okay, we're going to throw out the Chains of Corruption. Dazzle doesn't find too much as Keen has to slice his way out. Health lead for Gen G. As Life, he's happy to give away a bit of his health bar, as it looks like Afrika not willing to give this one up, as that's a double kill instantly from Fly! Finds the Shockwave, and now Lahens is looking to follow up. Rascal, it's going to take a bit of killing to get him down to subjugate is now ticking, Keen looking for the back line, wants to find the slice angle but doesn't quite get in there, but Clint's still taking way too much damage, and Afrika will be able to get this out of turret and the dragon. But that was just a fantastic play from Afrika. Let's have a look at it again. I think it was also, yep, they just, they, they don't see it. Didn't respect the orb. You gotta flash that. I, oh, I, I uh, Ruler really doesn't have flash uh, on this UI, but he did have flash on the early one. So that was like, I, I was like, why did he flash that? Because for life, it makes sense. Um, wow. Yeah. Uh, and then Anathema's on to Rise. Who kills it? No one. Exactly. True Shot Barrage does a lot of work there. Clint's in a bit of trouble. Solar Flare is going to connect. Lehens decides to actually hold back because the Shockwave is all they need to murder the oh, bear. 50 yeah. seconds. So. And we've seen this setup happen a couple of times already. I mean, for Genji, this is the team fight that you have to win. Trisha Barrage is going to come through. The flash comes out from life to avoid the solar flare. So no flash dazzles to come through here from him. Is okay. There's the ulti. They get the cosmic radiance. That's the first we've seen. It looks great. Does nothing. Oh, God. That's insane. They tried to go in. I was saying it jokingly. They tried to go in for the big play, and it didn't work. The pillar oh, cancelled it! Because BDD tried to Realm Warp! Yes! And I missed it! What a... I'm a bit of a numpty. Thankfully, we have Chronicle oh here to save God. me. Oh, my God! It would have worked! Oh, no. And now Rascal, he's getting chunked out. It's going to be hard for him to stick around as Keen is just <laughs> clearing out vision. The bottom side of the map, but there's nothing really to play for down there as Afrika have inside track towards the Baron Pit if they'd like to get there. Okay, Solar Flare going to connect onto Ruler. He cleanses immediately. As he is uh, very strange. Here it is. We're going to try it one more time. In they go. Cosmic Radiance. Rascal was outside of it, though. And he's just going to get chunked immediately. Ruler's in trouble. Keen goes down to his GA, and that is going to be Ruler already dead. BDD's gone as well. There is no damage remaining on Gen G, and I have a feeling they are no longer welcome in this game. This will be the turret taken down. This will most likely be the ace unless Clint is just going to stick on his fountain the entire time. And Afrika have done it. They have the Ocean Soul, they have a dream, and they will most likely have a slaughtered Nexus here in the Gen G base. Textbook game.
from a free gun. They read Genji like a book, and I don't think we're gonna see Fly play Oriana again, because while I think he's looked better and better. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 문준이 형이 잘했지. 아 죽이자 이거. 날아가 봐. 뭘 날아가? 날아가. 뭘 날아가? 플라이야? 